his troops. You're watching Wayne 15 First News Weekend. One of my favorite Halloween movies is Hocus Pocus, and today I'm using the movie's magic for Hocus Pocus rolls. So what do you need? A whole container of crescent rolls, some cinnamon and sugar, probably about an eighth a cup of uh, sugar, and then three tablespoons of cinnamon, about three tablespoons of butter melted, and then eight ma marshmallows, eight marshmallows almost had one in my mouth, so that's why that was a little tongue-tied. All right, so what are we going to do first? Preheat that oven to 375. Save you a lot of trouble later on. We're going to take a marshmallow, dip it into that melted butter, and then take it over to the cinnamon and sugar and just roll it around. Our next step is taking it to the crescent roll. You'll start at the skinny end and wrap it all up. And by now, you're like, well, Sierra, the marshmallow is just going to go everywhere. You're right, it would, but we're going to pinch these seams so it's nice and closed and the marshmallow cannot escape. Might take you a little bit of time to make sure all those seams are poked, I mean, sealed. Don't want to poke them. <laughs> all right, so that is what my hocus pocus roll looks like for now. You'll pop that into the oven for about 10 minutes, and then they turn into these guys. And if you can see, they're a little bit more flat. That's because the magic is the marshmallow disappears and makes it a whole lot sweeter for you. Now, the marshmallow is going to spread out of it. You can't really escape that at all, but it is nice to eat warm. You can sop up all of that marshmallow-y goodness. And unfortunately for Joe Struess this morning, he is not eating one that is warm. He is eating one that I made last night. So it has a little bit of a caramel crust to it. Huh. Let's see. <laughs> well, I was surprised. I, you said unfortunately. You got my attention. Unfor no, it's still going to be good. Oh, yeah, that's great. So wait, 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 wait. There's no apple in here? There's no apple in there. No. Do you taste apple? No, the cinnamon's just reminding me with the crust. I okay. think it, I think it set off an alarm in my head. What this what this reminds me of is if you had sort of a apple pie to go. Okay. Like this I could see I could see you putting some apple pie in here, some filling. Uh, I don't know if that's in the recipe, but but, <laughs> but you know what I'm saying. Like it's very fluffy, uh -huh. but it's got that kind of pie crust type. Well, that's the crescent roll in it, so... Right, it's good. And then the, the magic, of course, is there's no marshmallow to bite into. Right, so where do they go? They just disappear. That's that makes magic. it fluffy, right? No. That makes it sweet, Joe. Mmm. Yes. So if you want to try this recipe, I'll, of course, have it on Wayne.com later today, as well as all the other Cooking with Sierra recipes that I've done. Just go to Wayne.com, click the Lifestyle tab, and you'll see Cooking with Sierra.